Crew's gameplay video of Armored Battle Crew World War One. Uh, and they're flying. And here we are taking a look at another. Uh, another? What do you mean another? Uh, uh, I guess not. Um, well, a War One game. In the same vein as that other game that's like this. I'm completely blanking on what it's called. I am so sorry. Uh, I am so sorry. I, 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 I have com I, I may, have, I may, I may have completely forgotten what that's called. Um, you know, the game that's like this, where basically you, um, not quite, you not quite control a tank. Or, well, in that game, you didn't quite control a bomber, a Lancaster over Bryn. But you managed it. Um, this is a this is a game in that same vein, which is cartoonish graphics, um, and where you manage where you manage a tank, uh, where you manage a World War One tank instead of a uh, of a War Two bomber, which is all sorts of a good idea, to me. That sounds awesome. So we should play it because it sounds awesome. And I had to buy it on my own pocket because it sounded awesome. So here we are. Because it sounded awesome. Alrighty, language English, mouth sensitivity, that's bad, whatever that is. Yeah, I'm my computer, fantastic, alright, uh, drive forward, uh, do, do, do. we actually need to read this. Okay, I read, I read enough, hopefully there's on-screen bomb prompts, encyclopedia, yay, tutorial! Ah. Uh, well, I mean, maybe I should be, because I'm solving the issue of reading, it really hurts my brain. To the point where I can't even read my own, uh, read my own, uh, read, uh, well, write. To ability, I can't even edit my own book. Um, that was fun. Okay. No, we're still doing the tutorial. Fantastic. Okay. My question is, is it going to be a campaign like the other game? Which, I would say it's name, I just don't know, I just forget it. I just, I just have forgotten it. Or is it, you know, a, um, also, this is very Wolf Tanks and Warfare-like. And also, is it just me, or di or did the, um, is it just me, or did the, um, is it just me, or, France, um, is it just me, or did the logo look French? Not that it's bad. Just, you know. I mean, not the, uh, I, but I'm, I'm staring at that. I'm staring at the Mach 17. I want it. I mean, we're not 17. I want it. I meant, does it look like Armored Warfare? Whose logo? Logo female. By the way, uh, males have cannons. Females have machine guns. Composites have both. Or composites. What is the difference between composites? And also the responses they got right there. A Wumpet is basically a British for it's a pretty it's a it's a World War One British wanting wanting a light tank yet failing on how to actually make a light tank. Um no well, let's make a male. Or let's have a male, um Arsenal. Sixteen pounder. And of course you can customize everything like in the other game. Barrack. Driver armor. You can have heavy armor. Paint. Oh yeah, let's go plain. Actually, you know, let's go dazzle. Um, dazzle. Pretty much is how zebras do things. Where the the idea is to make. The idea is to make it so you can't really aim w very well, like you can't tell what's what. Um, ships used it. I'm not quite sure how effective it was on ships, but they used it. Um. Okay, coming to that pole. Okay, right, that's all we got. Let's battle. Just about, please. Actually, I better go on the playground. 
cool thing. The question is, is it going to be uh, it's going to be a strategy game, a, ta uh, a tactical game where we tell our tank where to go, or is it going to be as a management, but not the as a management, but not the um, um, but not the strategy of the other game. Okay, it's definitely you know it has the management fun and has the and has the ability for you to drive a tank. Okay, let's do the driving course. The controls feel nice. The graphics are good. Oh, oh well, these things don't turn in this game. I mean, it's the one thing they probably didn't turn very well in real life either. Stop turn. Okay, I like the controls. Oh, oh, that might be fire. And the paint targets. Okay, I'm getting it. Okay, I'm liking this. Else makes me want to go back to the uh, war, uh, to that World War One World Tanks game, which I will eventually. Sure. But yeah, I mean, I've always liked World War One tanks because, again, they are you know land cruisers, you know land fortresses. You just have so many guns. Why not learn to control them? I like this range, it's good. Why'd you pick that from him? Why? Light gun. Pick my cannon. Why are you listing on him? Ah, control, there we go. You need to control, go, go through positions. Um, don't. Please don't. Like, no. I can click on them too. Gotcha. Okay, I got it. I got it. We can try the rest of the range later. Let's try some action. Custom battle, please. Uh, difficulty medium, because that's just how I roll on this channel. Range. Sure, how about this for the range? Right. Yeah, no, let's do, let's do this first now. Bad morning, uh, this artillery, strip up word. Gotcha, gotcha. You're looking for battle, are you sure? Are you sure you don't want to go, turn ho go home? <laughs> well, yeah, I mean, the reason why um, I prefer this over the other game um, is because the other game was kind of limited to the campaign. Um, whereas this has custom metal, which is amazing. Um, Commander, the infantry will be launching an attack on point enemy in, five, in 15 minutes from your position. Or in 15 minutes from your position. <laughs> infantry. Now, enemy artillery spot at the edge of the map. Take and destroy. Okay, okay. okay. This pesky one will surely not create crush them. Yes, what the tanks are for then. We're back. Okay, they are taking 15 minutes. Um, 
Marker should go through. Oh, my. I need to learn how to dodge in like five seconds. I wish I wish the icons were over over the enemy. I mean, handy. Angle. Have they repaired? Gotcha. Finally, chief. Oh, you're not done yet. Got side guns. Get him, please! Did someone prioritize that guy? Oh, why are you shooting your cannon at him? You right click? Oh no, engine's done. To the driver. Um, who can refer the engine? up. No! Get on it. Get driving. cover. Okay, click on names. I wish you could. She 
Come after. Oh, uh, we're suffering. Okay. I wish he could heal himself. That'd be good. Oh, shotgun. Uh, someone needs to get help because he can't get himself for some reason. So far, though, um, it, like I wish you could click on names for one. Okay, now I'm going to run and get ammo for everybody, right? Oh, we got to fix it. Fantastic. Let me switch to the other side. Oh, we. I'm opposing tank or pack gun. Attack it, we need to get that artillery. We have a mission. No, no, let's go. Oh, get that guy, please. Get him, get him, get him. Oh, that's good. Okay, don't ever get this close to artillery, kids. I mean, this close to infantry, kids. That's not a good idea. Back it up, back it up, back it up. No, he's better on that gun. Grenade bundles. Uh, it's a bit too easy to lose your guys in this. Get the ammo. Place it. Now where's the tower? Now where's the enemy tanks? Get the cannon rounds. Sounds nice. Uh, I might as well get health in here. Oh, we don't have any. Oh, they can get them off the map. Okay, sure. Get on your cannon. 
Oh no! Reverse! Get ammo, get ammo, get ammo! I am. How are you still on those fun guns? Get ammo! Over there now! Turn around. Oh, actually, go forward faster. Girl, 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 girl. Oh, no. Oh, we got more. Oh, you're down to that. That's not good. Get it. Get medkits. Get medkits. We need our guys up now. You went down first. Girl, 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 girl. Where are the artillery? She ran her somewhere. Go to him too. Go to him too. What do you have in your hand? Get guns up. Get ammo to the machine. Fire her. Jeez, come on. Mid gets doing this. Come on. Get up, get up. There you go. Go, go, go. We meet you the we meet you the enemy, we meet you the enemy base. Cannon rounds. Oh, I'll tell you, you bugger. Oh, you're gonna freaking snipe me now. You're gonna, you got a shotgun. Okay, sure. Oh, you're tiny. Uh, that's why I called you a bugger. You're tiny. Bugger in my language means tiny old thing. By the way. Pick that up instead. Oh. You're gonna need to pick that up instead. You're gonna need to get your kin around to you. You're gonna need to get on the cannon. Wrong type. Oh, that's not good. Oh, would you? Oh, he's dead. Oh, um, never mind. Actually, no, he's reviving. Okay, that's good. Okay, throw these on the gun. Oh, no, he's definitely dead. Need the other machine gun. Oh, yeah, so the Germans get rid of but we don't. Keep firing! Soldier switch to AG, I know. I mean, switch to AB, I know it's a friggin' um, artillery, but still. Yep, gotta get around it. You're going down, little guy, you're going down. Stop firing. Stop firing. Move it, move it, move it, move it. I see that gun. Oh, uh. Could that have been any closer? Could that have realistically been any closer? Okay, well, we got a sec. Heal everybody up. Except William. He tried. Actually, Ernest. I'll go down. Everybody get on the engine too. Oh no, bring in your seats. There, let's get back on your gun. We need to get uh, cannon shells for these guys. Again, we might as well take a second. I like to tell you that the wrong type. So we got one artillery. Okay, we're good. Um, can we save? No, we can't. Of course we can. Okay, now we need to go to the other side. I mean, okay, the um, are attacking soon. No, we don't got any grants there. Canister is really nice. Oh, they got trans. Repair it. Oh. We'll repair that anyway. Let's 
radio, I think. Oh, enemy artillery spotted. Switch to AP. Ambush almost down. Enemy tank spotted, sir. Now you fight early. Get on target, get on target, get on target. Really snowing the artillery today. We're doing one good job today. Oh, we're running out of fuel desperate. We need fuel, we need to stop at some place. Well, at least infantry are going to have something, something to deal with. We need, get, we need to get in front. Fire! There you go. Oh, you can only really fire forward if you got gotcha. you. Ah, trees exist. Stop. Fire! Oh, fire's not ready yet. Fire's not ready yet. Fire's not ready yet. No, 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 please, please, no. There we go. Oh, perfect. That's golden. There you go. They're smoking. They're smoking. Another good one. Man, it's almost like battleship gameplay. Like war warships. Oh no, we lost the Ernest. It's mo uh, it's steaming. It's steaming. Oh no, we're stuck. Uh oh. Uh oh, we're stuck. Take it out! We will at least get the bonus points. Open fire, take it out. Yeah, we got it! Did we get detracted? Or are we just stuck? Yeah, we got detracted. Some ammo. Uh, no, we're still drag. We're still drag. Never mind. Give him some ammo quickly. Oh. Um, can we get this back up there, man? Pretty much. Okay. Get on that gun. Get on that gun. We're still not moving. Makes that track move. Now they got us! They got us! Oh, that was good! I like that! That was fun! It won't live! Yay! Yeah, that, that's what you get for that flying campaign. game after my first battle um i liked it it was fun um can i get my 14 or uh, 19 uh well i paid less than that because steam summer sell um but can i get 19 dollars out of the game oh no i actually i know I, I actually got this game on really same amount i didn't get this game on steam summer sell um i got this game on really so i paid 19 dollars and i got a supporter pack so um is it worth um is it still worth 19 dollars to me I would say yes it is. Um, it's still worth it. Um, it. It's... I don't think there's a lot of content really in the game right now. I mean... Let me check. Now they're going to add more British World War One vehicles.
Okay, so, yeah, they're definitely going to, uh, basically, it's going to be just more content. The game's mostly done. So, is it worth it uh, without having played in the campaign mode? Um, I would say $19 is worth it. Um, if you like this type of game, you know, if you, if you always, uh, basically, if you always wanted more War 110 games, which there are so few of, as in I can only name two, this one and my other one, um, which I already did on the channel a long time ago, um, but you know, it's definitely, uh, it's definitely, definitely worth it, um, however, the action is really slow, um, there could be a bit more feedback on what's going on, like, I wouldn't be ashamed to use a, um, like, here are where enemies are indicator, and I wish people, I wish your crew were more accurate, um, than they are, because they're kind of terrible right now, well, I mean, the machine guns, the cannons are fine with being inaccurate, but even though, even then, they still shoot them out, they still shoot the nails like fools, um, but, you know, I mean, it, it's, I could, you know, it, it's good, um, so, yeah, I, I, I guess it is worth it, um, based on, based on my binary choice with a whole lot of butts for both, um, yeah, I, I guess it is worth it, um, however, again, it's, it's more for a more slower tactical gamer, um, who can get, uh, who can, like, in a uh, few games I've been playing recently, um, but who, uh, but you have to have the, you have to be able to spin pledge, you have to be able to drive the tank, uh, which I do wish you, I, I wish you could prioritize, tar I wish you could prioritize targets, and also, uh, tell you, and also command where your tank will go on the map, um, because right now, again, you need to be able to be a good driver, and a good finagling everyone in position. Um, so, yeah, I mean, uh, so, like, that's what I would change is add the ability to uh, designate targets and add the ability to, um, move the mouse by clicking. Um, well, I mean, it will have to be a key combination, like control click or something, but still. Um, so you don't, ac so you don't accidentally move while, um, uh, while, you know, while doing, while managing your crew. But anyway, yeah, I, I think it's good. So, yeah, that'll be it for today. Thanks for watching. Do appreciate you watching all of these uh, video, videos and thoughts to me. Also, I mean, if you were to, um, if you were to, I'm also being let me if you were, um, if you were to check out their straight part, their verse. On the sci-fi universe, uh, I've been playing, uh, um, I've been playing it since I was a kid. And now, and just now I've decided to turn it into a, you know, sci-fi setting. And yeah, I'm, I'm writing, um, I, I, I'm writing, a, I'm going to be writing a tons of books in it, hopefully everything goes well. Um, but I, I'm almost done with my first book. I'm just now in the editing process, in the final edits. Uh, well, maybe not. Yeah, I would say final edits. Um, in the final edits, before the hopeful release of September 9th. Or sometime in 2019, or sometime before summer of 2020. Whatever happens first, I'm able to do. Because um, I've never done this before. But yeah, but anyway, you can check out the uh, draft of it below. I'll be updating it sometime in uh, sometime in the first week of July, um, uh, when I make when I uh, uh, because right now I'm, I'm busy editing, so I want to get as far as I can before I post up another update onto the uh, Google Drive folder. By the way, um, by the way, you can find that in the description below, below the uh, playlist, below the line, the find Google Drive folder, and also if you want to see lower files of my sci-fi universe, um, which. There are heavy tanks, uh, with real guns and stuff, uh, tank uh, heavy, and even super heavy tank destroyers are, um, are also kind of common in my universe, <laughs> based on what I've written already. And yeah, um, check that out in the story below, uh, in the uh, link below, where you can also find the lore files and the uh, address of my books. And yeah, and below that, you can, and below that, you can... Um, and below that, you can, um, oh, sorry, and below, and below that, um, there's my Discord if you want to come hang out with me and the rest of our community here on the internet, and, uh, and also if you, um, have the means and would like to donate, you can to, uh, let me to buy more games like this because I pay for this out of pocket and other management action I guess action management games is what we're calling these now. Yeah, action management games. And by the way, the other, uh, the other game I'm picking up is Dark Future. Oh, I'm terrible. I'm sorry. 
Um, but yeah, the other game, the other game, the other game I'm talking about is Dark Future. Um, so yeah, you can check out that. You, you can check out my Dark Future playthrough, which I'm not going to link in the description because it's not really related to this. Um, no, maybe I should. Yeah, well, we'll see. Um, uh, it's your team policies. But anyway, um, so you can also, uh, your donations will also go into hardware, like components, so I can play on my mass computer, which, make it, which will make it even easier for me to record and not, and not to, and not to, um, burn up my laptop. Also, my mass, also, if I get my mass computer or a new hard drive, I can put Windows 10 on it, so it doesn't, because Windows 10 right now crashes my, um, uh, uh, Chris crashes my desktop every um every now and then whenever it revs up, um whenever it revs up it crashes pretty much, um, yeah, and it does cr and it does crash at least once a day if it does literally nothing, and by revving up I mean even and word processors like Word or LibreOffice yes it, it crashes, yeah, um or shuts down or does whatever it does it's it's a weird Windows 10 bug that apparently is extremely rare. Um, but my cousin hopes that it's just because Windows 10 wants to be on a fresh hard drive, which we'll see. But anyway, alright, so that'd be it for this video, and of course you don't have to do it if you don't want to. Um, you know, and it's more than amazing that you all, um, stop, stop by and, uh, hang, and, you know, hang out, and, and hang out with me every now and then. I really do appreciate it, and yeah. Alright, so that'd be it for this video. Thanks for watching. And I guess, see you in